Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another episode of, what did we call this series again? The Life of an Underplayed Legacy Deck? Something like that. Yeah, something like that. Yeah. Infect versus X, that's what we're calling it. <laughs> this week, no not week, this episode, I have no regular schedule, I haven't even posted one in a while. It is, what's your deck? Esper Stoneblade. Yes! Yes! Esper Stoneblade. Um, I, is it True Name? Yeah, I only have one copy though, so okay. it's not really like That's a full fledged fair. true name. It, it works. Yeah, it works. It's it's a uh, true true name isn't necessary. It's just no, you're amazing. Right. I I am a big fan of true name, but at the same a uh, big fan in terms of play. As far as actual design of the card, why wizards? I why? I totally agree. I'm totally you know like whenever I think of the card. From a design standpoint, it's like, why? It is literally I one know. of the most uninteractive cards mm. ever made. And it's an EDH card where there's so many more ways to deal with it and choose target player. I mean, it's a, you know, we, I don't know. I, mean, I don't I, play I guess, single player EDH much. I guess it's, in that sense where you play multiplayer EDH, yeah, that's what it I'm is saying. terribly bad. But outside of that, it's, it, it just destroys kitchen table magic. Literal kitchen table magic mm. going on here. All right, let me do a handy dandy little. Well, if yours ever <laughs> wants to fall, this doesn't want to cut. Yeah. All right, here we go. Uh, how do I want to do my deck? This. Let's do it sideways. Oh, let's let you take a look at the pretty little girls. That. No, no, that's not how I'm at. Whatever. <laughs> screw it. Screw it. That made it worse. Not screw it. No, no never mind. Thank you. Okay, seven. How many of those do you have by chance? Uh, probably like two or three. Oh, well, that's nine. What's there? Okay. That's a six. Here we go. Ready? Yep. Oh, no, no, no. We're, no. we're classy. Let's do this. Yes. All right. I don't care if you, if you want to have a drink. <laughs> These are just my poison counters. All right. Yes, I'm on the play. Turn the lens around, and in the process, surely knock the camera off its alignment, so that I can show you, wonderful people, what I have here. Okay, let me sort. Let me sort these. Ooh, I think I might have just shown him actually. That has me a bit worried, but I can play through it because of that. All right, and you can do it now if you'd like. Glug, glug. It's an okay hand. Uh, it's not really what I want. It's it gets there, but I'm a little worried about his some of his potential counter magic. That and he kind of plays like a blitz deck, and that's um. Gotta go fast. <laughs> Mm. All right, well, I'll keep. All right, let's flip it back over. Ha. Huh. And let's start off with... Dun, 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 dun. I had plenty of time to think about it. You know what? Sure. Learning Catacomb. Fetch. Okay. So, roll me down to 19... Let's not forget that again. Do 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 by you. Now is your infect deck complete, or are you always like main board is complete? The only thing I'm missing at this point is X abrupt abrupt decays. Maybe four actually. Uh, just counterbalance, tarmogoyf, that sort of thing. Uh. Miracles eats this deck. I, so that's why I don't play Tarmogoyf? Uh, no, sorry? You oh, said Tarmogoyf. Playing against Tarmogoyf, for oh, instance. Oh, okay. No, I, I definitely don't play Tarmogoyf in this deck. Uh, I'm gonna hit you with a Gitaxian probe, pay myself down a bit. Oh, Force of Will? No, I'm <laughs> Oh, fun. Well, we're at. Oh, 
I, I see something I don't like. I see swords to plowshares. Okay. So I can't hit Marsh Flats, Academy Ruins. I see two Snapcasters, a Stone Forge, a Sword, and an Inquisition. Ugh. 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 Normally I would write this down. I think I can memorize this. Especially the threats that I'm, I'm staring down the barrel of. That's nice and fun. Alright, display my graveyard, draw a card. Um, let's do it again! No need to show. Come on, bruh. And... Hmm... Don't look! Don't look! Those are the two I'm deciding. Oh, yeah. Might as well. Might right. as well. Glistener Elf and yeah. Pastor. No Cabal Therapy. Oh, phone call. Sorry. Okay. Hello? We'll just, uh, we'll cut this. What just got done? And we're back. Eh, it happens. Yeah. Was that the Mrs. To Be? Yeah, and this is to be. Yes. <laughs> All right. Okay. I got it. Then. Got a couple Would lines. Well, oh, I'm just saying that. I don't know. <laughs> hmm. Got a couple lines of play. I'm not quite sure which is correct here. Wish I had a Jataxian probe right about now too. Um, leading off with Marsh Flat seems about right, since it's the only colored source at the moment. Okay. Hmm. Good. I think I'll crack that. Go down to 19. Uh, I'm gonna get some more water boiling, so hide that for just a second. I'm not turning around. Still not turning. Makes walking really awkward. Okay. Maybe tundra. Tundra. Oh, makes sense. I haven't really gotten all those crazy shuffle shenanigans down yet. People that can. Ooh, yep. Source of flash errors on your glistener elf. Glissy be gone. Oh, excuse me, let me turn it sideways so you know he's exiled. Alright, um. I'll go back. 16. Up. Yep. And that'll be all for my turn. Okay. When you were doing that, I was going, okay, there is a right answer here. I, there is, objectively speaking, a right answer. To me making my play? Yeah. Yeah. I was afraid of potential days coming if you just drop a single blue source. No, yeah. uh, it's, it's by you, so... Well, I mean, that's yeah. what I mean, is I, I can't wait till your turn. That's right. Oh, you meant, like, for the swords? Yeah, for the swords. Uh, I don't know what you're doing. play a Tropical Island? Tap two. Mm-hmm. Come at me, brah. Plague Stinger. And here gotcha. comes... No, it doesn't nope. resolve. It does resolve. Okay. Yep. And I pass my turn. see that better. Yeah, F and M promos on the probe and the L. Ah, oh, here we go. Go ahead and brainstorm here. Okay. Uh, hide, I did a bit, sorry. Oh, sorry. I did, I did see one of them. I mean, it, when it's a casual game like this, you, you may not pay attention to stuff like that, but yeah, I did, I did catch a glimpse. 
There's no worries, no worries. Yeah. Hey, yep. Cards that you've seen are probably going to get shipped anyway, so it's no worries. Mm. 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 I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> It's tough, isn't it? The challenges of being a blue mage. Ooh, Inquisition. Uh, whoops. There we go. Okay, that okay, understood. There. <laughs> understood. So, everything in my hand is a target. Invigorate, invigorate, berserk, and noble hierarch. Double invigorate. Double invigorate. Gotta remind myself of... That is extremely pretty. Mm, isn't it? Yeah. Well, let's see. Cast four. So it's only as good as how big the creature is, including mm -hmm. these. Um, yep. Control, force rather than three new great. Yeah, he gains three completely irrelevant life in this matchup. And my creature goes to 5-5. Five, five. Or 4-5 for Noble, but... I mean, I have gotten Noble straight. kills before. I think I'll take the Invigorate there. Okay. Invigorate number one be gone. Yep. And uh, so that'll be it for my turn. Yeah. All right. Untappity tap tap. I too would have liked to have a notepad there. Yeah. You're telling me. All right. Let's start off with a noble hierarch. Mm-hmm. Swing exalted trigger. That is fine. Okay. Invigorate. Invigorate. So it's two or six. Yeah. So yeah. It's six right now. That's right. Uh. Force of will. Interesting. Exiling Jace. Okay. Let me let me think about this then. Um. Okay, it, it resolves. Okay. Uh, you don't gain the three, but whatever. And that's two at you. Gotcha. I got it, I got it. R R that, that's my side down. He evolves putting them. Boing, boing. <laughs> Pass turn. You know, if you're not going to drink that tea, We'll switch decks entirely. I'll switch mine, you switch yours. 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 Snapcaster Mage. Okay. Gonna go ahead and flash back. Yeah. So that is the correct move. Wait, um, Let me think about this. Uh, nope, I'll gain another life. Alright, back to 17. Pass turn. Here we go. Come on, deck. Oh, that would have been bad. Judge? No. <laughs> Judge. <laughs> Sticky sleeve. They're triple sleeve because I'm I'm paranoid. I'm paranoid too. We're yeah, I totally go. understand that. Sometimes I look at my double sleeve and I'm like, you know, that's not good enough. Ink Moth Nexus. Uh huh. Um, let's try one. Two, 
I hear you, water. Uh, blighted agent, I'm gonna go and get the water. Okay. Okay. Permission Does it resolve? Yep. Okay. And sweat now. <laughs> <laughs> no. Um. That's a perfectly good, viable play. You should do it. Yeah, yeah, right? <laughs> I pass my turn. Good right. sir. Don't see a reason not to play that. Okay. Um. You have any artifacts in your graveyard now? Not at the moment. Okay. Glad I don't have any artifacts. I'd rather not stack the top of my deck and just. Mm. Well, it's always good to have an op. Ah, here we go. Stoneforge. Yep. I wonder what you're going for. I'm gonna pull that GT out. Yep. Judge promo, is that it? Yep. Nice. That's beautiful. Let me That's what I was missing for a while. Oh. Oh, isn't that just oh glare I have a batter skull next to that, like yeah. a GP promo. Oh yeah. See that? Ah. Okay, I'm gonna <laughs> be fine with it. And uh blighted agent is unblockable, right? That's correct. Okay. Uh go ahead and swing the snapcaster mage for two. <laughs> okay. Set that over. Yeah. Drop it, Yumi Zawa's Jite, and pass turn. Yep. So right. basically There's I'm on a one you, turn clock. I guess I'm hoping you don't peel like an invigorate off the top. Hmm. <sighs> Hi Jite. I came across you so much at GPDC. Uh, was it the bane of your existence? Usually, I could, like, because this deck is pretty quick, right. the turn after they searched it, I could do it. I could right. finish them, but if not, you know, they had me. Yeah. Um, I had to go to sideboard, you know, nature's claim. Yeah, that's, that's definitely a thing. Yep. Yes, it is. Um, let's try... Man, I don't know. What do you do here? What do you do here? Mm. Swing, exalted trigger. Okay, some lock boy, yes. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Mm hmm. Um, That's fine. There's not a costless fog in this game yet. <laughs> I don't think so, at least. What do you mean there's not a costless fog? I am going. Well. I am working on a Turbo Fog deck. Problem is, right. I looked it up on TCG Player. Um, no, nothing in. Yeah, nothing additional on it. So it's yeah, just two at right. you. That's two fine. more. Um, Wait, I there, looked it up on TCG is Player. Is there a Process Fog deck or a card? Uh, Instant Speed. Kind of like I think there's the white I, one I where you have to tap the your that's, mana. That's not your hand. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking in another direction. Um, you can take your turn. All right. Um, what was I saying? Oh yeah. Um, no, no, I have no idea. What was I just talking about? Um, some kind of turbo fog deck. Oh yeah, seventeen hundred ninety dollars when I looked it up on TCG Player. Sheesh. Most of it is held up by two cards. Tabernacle. Tabernacle is one good. Yeah. And what's the en what's the enchantment fog that's three hundred more than three hundred dollars? You know, let me think about it for a second. I think it's more than three hundred. Kind of. It's not quite fog. It Don't doesn't stop everything like, from attacking. It's like Abeons? Uh that's that's in the deck. That's in okay. the side deck. Good no, guess. I, I don't know. It's moat. Right. I yeah. forget I forget that's a land that's a, an enchantment and not a land. Yeah, four drop when that hits yeah. it just it shuts some decks just down. Bossies. Your only target's Berserk. I was dis I was deciding. Oh, it's by you, by the way. Oh, okay. I was deciding. Do I want to use that now? Because I know I'm going to lose my creature. Oh, Does your creature die if you use it? Yes. I can't remember. That's text. that's why I was thinking about that. Oh, whoops! I dropped your health down too. I should be dropping my health down too. Yeah. All right. Uh, two. Equip two. Um, 
snack cast. Good choice. A little overtime now. <laughs> Smash it for two. Uh, well, Ink Moth will block. Okay. It'll trade, trade, but then you get counters. Two counters. Yep. Go ahead and. What happened to the fourth? Oh, okay. There's a the fourth dice. I'll get two counters on this. Go ahead and use both of them to kill those. Feels like uh, tap four, tap four, <laughs> green, and, and, no. Nope. Uh, pass the turn. And at this point, he's still got a creature out, so it's pretty much game. Pretty much. Um, one, two. I'm not sure if this is the right move or not. Well, you don't have too many options in this order. Blighted Agent? Right. Oh, not not that. It was a different oh. thing I was debating. Oh, okay. And... Pass turn. Hang on to the land so you can brainstorm it back on top. I'm fine. Wait. Draw. That's not what I needed, but that's fine. Um... I'm gonna tap these two. Yep. Quip. Smash in for one. Yeah, I don't have a lot of options here. Yeah. Do I? It's gonna die anyway. Nope. Let's let's take it. All, All right. right. So you go down to fourteen. Remove the, the counter to kill the blighted agent. Yep. Remove That's one. It. Kill it. You're back to one counter on it. Yeah. Pass turn. Yeah. Pass turn. All right. Let's see if I can. Nope. I'm just gonna call that game. I'm just. Yeah. I don't run main board in artifact destruction, and now he's on a roll. So. Yeah. Yep. Let's see if we can do this in game two. The really bad version, it's like a really beaten up or old ones is 20, yeah. but it's 25-ish. Like, even yeah. if you can buy for 22, people are probably not going to sell for less than that. No, I believe uh, you. Like, what happened was, say about sometime during over winter break, the mm -hmm. foil prices started going up, and we were like, oh, well, it's just the foil prices going up. And for quite a long while, like, it was just foils. Like, it went from 50 to 70 to 80 to 90. Now $130 per is good. Yeah. Like, that's an amazing yeah. deal if you buy it at 130 Because it's like 160 to 170 Almost um, Stoneforge, man. Then only about a week or two ago, maybe like about two weeks running now, Stoneforge jumped up to about $30. You know, Blue so, White, Red, Delver, won. and Death and Taxes have both been doing pretty well. I'm on the play. Yeah. Been doing pretty well, so... Yes, it's kind of funny because like when you when you look back and you think about it, it's like Stoneforge has been in so many more decks, mm. like arguably more than Jace, That's and true. we just took it for granted that it was like nine, ten bucks. And I mean, when everyone's buying the, uh, trying to find Jaces, they're also flooding the market with Stoneforge. So yeah, sometimes sometimes they'll want both, but okay, a lot of times they'll want both. I'm gonna flip first right. and show them what I've got. Like, comment, subscribe. I mean, uh... <laughs> Fairly ideal hand, I guess. Like, some stuff I would have liked better, but I, I think it's pretty solid. I think if I draw into the rest of it, I don't know, I'll be fine. I'm just more afraid of, like, turn one kill. <laughs> that, that would hurt. Uh, yeah, I'll keep... Well, I have good news for you. No haste, no haste creatures <laughs> here, so... Turn yeah. two at the earliest. Alright, let's give it a go. I was about to draw. No, that's not how this works. Um, Ink Moth. Gotcha. Pass turn. Ink Moth on... First turn. Yep. First turn. Oh. Um, <laughs> Fast turn. Ooh. Okay. Do I? Do I? Don't daze me, bro. 
Let's see, I'll crack. Yep, down to 19. 19. Right, search for the card first. Huh. Uh, 19 might as well be 20, though, so. Tundra. Yep, here she comes. Let's see. Um, hmm, what do I do in this situation? I'm still on the stack. Yep. I'm trying to figure out what I want to do. Okay. Dang it. Yep. Lovely. Let's see, I was at 19. Yep. You got it. Did you did you crack the fetch line? No, no, I just right. played it. Okay. Um Yep. Alright. Still on the stack. Force? Yep. Coming with. Pitch Supreme Verdict. And she's out of here. He. Whatever. And past time. Dodge one bullet, hopefully. Yeah, five cards? Five. Five cards, alright. One of those five are the threatening ones. Which one could it be? That sounds like no. Oh, no black. So that sounds like the Cabal Therapy thought process. Pass the turn. Okay. It's probably something I need to get better at as I'm playing a couple balls. And, um... All right, let's try Bayou. Mm -hmm. Can they? Yeah, they can see that. That's fine. Bayou resolves. <laughs> <laughs> Perp derp. Okay. Um, let's make Ink Moth a creature. Okay. Swing? Uh, that's fine. Is it still Great. fine? Great. Yeah, that's fine. So I can't do it. Is it still fine? Westwood? Hexproof? Okay, here we go. Fetch. Is that a scrubland? Okay. the other way, doesn't it? Yeah. As if it matters. Right. Um, I have five imaginary life points over there. And I... Dang it. Pass the turn. Jeez. Oh, no, that was good. Oh, Esper. So you have two, two cards. Two. Right. Uh... Brainstorm? Yep. Yeah, try not. Oh, uh, sorry. And it happens. I that. actually really need that. As long as he keeps pitching stuff, I'm kind of okay with it, for the most part. Okay. Okay. 
shuffle away those bad brainstorm targets, bad brainstorm cards. And now have the trifecta. Mm. Yep. That blue mana. That every mana. Okay. I wonder what you're getting. Yep. Hi, G J. Okay. Ink Moth Nexus. Mm -hmm. May I? Yep. Oh, sorry. No, it's fine. It's fine. It's, it's casual. Still, you know, do it the way we supposed to. Uh, here comes a blighted agent. What okay. say you? Oof. Oh wait, wait. wait. Are you? It's yeah, it yeah. resolves? It, it resolves. Oh, okay, okay. Right. Turn on the turn. Turn on the turn. Hmm. Maybe this card isn't so good against you. Future reference. Hmm. Just one card, yes? Uno. He. Wait, that's all Japanese. Each? Is that... Okay. Sword? Um, why did they get? Yep, Exiles, I am at 26. And I shall pass my turn. May I take a look at your graveyard? Yeah. Okay. So just to be clear, I see one, two, three swords to plush. <laughs> oh, fun. Okay. So now, untapity tap tap. Pink Moth, mm -hmm. again. The one that, okay, I'm animate this one. Okay. Main phase, Mind of Old Crosa. Mind of Old Crosa, target creature gets plus two, plus two. If you play this spell turn. Okay, so yes. it's a five. Yeah. It's a five, five, swing. All right, uh, I guess I'll take five. You take five. Yep. And because I have to do this, or I can bust. Go ahead and just put down the units I was to take off the yep. seven port. Wait. No, no, I, I just, did I just play it last turn? Uh, no, no, I did not. I had an untapped okay. phase. Wait, yeah, yeah, I had No, that's phase. right, because you yeah. can do it at the end of my turn. That's right, you're good. Okay. Alright. Yep. And it gets ugly again. Yeah, just a tad. Swing in for one, which you had 25. <laughs> yeah. Um, two of these counters. And pass to you. Okay. Well, the good news is they can't be targeted yet. Let me put go down to 23. Take a okay. look at your hand. It is uh, Brainstorm and Perish. Perish. Destroy all green creatures. That's a sorcery speed. Can't yep. Perish. Okay. So, I figured that it'd be pretty good, but... It's proving not to be so great right now. No, I, I hear you on that. Hmm, I think I'm at 7, 16, should be 16. Hmm. I'm gonna go ahead and gain life off of GTA. I to you, say. <laughs> In response to your stalling over here. <laughs> Glistener L. Okay. And pass. Go ahead and remove one to kill the glistener. Okay. Uh, brainstorm and phase. Mm hmm. Either that, ladies and gentlemen, or both of those being yeah. wrecked. My turn. I think that Draw probably turn. was a misplay. I'm about to find out. I'm about to find out. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and swing it for one. Block. Uh, before blockers. Okay. Remove to yep. kill. And I guess hit for one then. Yep. At twenty-two. 
That's what I was worried about too, though. If he hit, had the two counters and I just broke both of the ink moth next to yeah. next eye, he'd just take them both. So I didn't really know what the right move to do there was. Yeah, it's um, it's hard. It's hard to beat an active GT, honestly. It is. Yeah. Blighted agent. Yeah, that works. <laughs> I wonder how this is going to go. Kill it. Uh, I mean, yeah, so, in response. Okay. It'd be dead. Untap. Draw. Swinging for, uh, swinging for three. Swinging for three, okay. Now I'll have to actually use my dice. I'm at 19, aren't I? Yes, you're okay. at 19. Game um, two again? Yep, pass the turn. Alright. Come on, deck. Stop doing this to me. Pass turn. No, really, I have stuff I can do. I just... You know. Yeah, well, patience is a virtue. Swinging for one. Okay. Turn 18. Go to four. Good. Uh, not quite sure. Three. It couldn't hurt. Bossies. Finds a vast wood. Uh, go ahead and take that. Then. All right. And um, last turn. Okay. Noble, pass turn. Okay. Hmm. Yeah, that's fine. Untap, draw. Mm -hmm. As you can see at this point, I have a few outs just in case he gets back in. Uh, that doesn't sound good. Swing in as a 1 2. Block? Block? Uh, yeah, that's actually, I'll remove one. Yep. And, okay, I still block because I'm stupid. No, uh, it happens. Turn 2, or uh, second main. Yeah. Humility? Yep. He loses all abilities as a 1 1. Yeah. It doesn't override your Ink Moth, though, as because if. Because your Ink Moth comes in later, it has like a different timestamp. That's. Yeah, that's right, isn't it? Yeah, uh, pass turn. Crazy timestamp rules on that. Yeah. Forest! <laughs> Pass turn. Yeah, this is gonna get... We have shenanigans going on here. Oh, fine. Uh, swing in for one. Remove all three. Yep. One. No block. Okay. Three, six, seven, seven damage. damage. One, two. Swing in eleven. Back two. Pass turn. Ed, this is dangerous. I'm living dangerously here. Hmm. Okay, and last turn. Okay, now I, I have something I can do. Let me think okay. how this is going to work. And I'm at 11, aren't I? Yeah. Okay. Uh, swing? You're, you're swinging? Uh, yeah. Yeah, enter a damage step unless, unless you, um, enter you're not, block. Okay, so no counters being added? No counters being added until a damage step. Is that fine? Oh, let me, let me think then. Alright, alright. Um, so you're not doing anything during the declare attackers? No. Entering blocker step, or yeah. about to. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. It's a one. Okay. 
This is going to be so stupid. I'm going to give it Berserk. I see. So it's going to have... Trample okay. and gets plus, plus Palpian. X, which depends on when it res like Yes. You, res you see so, why I'm thinking about this. Gotcha. So, so if you remove both counters... I'll yeah. pump it to... 5-5. Five, 5-5. Five. Five, five. Okay, now it's 10. So 10. And I have 1. In response to that card after the well, in response to GTA. Okay. I also play Zealous Persecution. Bring it up to a so six. That's an six. instant. Woo! Okay, okay. Now now wait, wait. Okay, okay. We're still in declare blockers. Alright. Wait, but it's too late for me to declare blockers, isn't it? A little bit, yes. It is? Yeah. Well, uh you're you're casting this on the declare. It wouldn't matter anyway because No, yeah, yeah. Until I'll... end of turn it would kill Ink Moth Nexus anyway. Well, Whew. I mean, I have man. I have oh passed. man, that was good. Good games. Yeah. I so think, I think there, if I wanted to use Berserk, I would have to use the GTA's ability in response to this card. Yeah. So I would have to use it all right then and there if I wanted to get the double. Where are you? Where in this deck? Seriously? I have four of you. Nature's claim. That was my one out to Umazawa's Jite, gotcha. Nature's Claim. And it was, how many cards was that? Like 10? Right. No, good game, man. Good, good game. games. Whew. Okay, now do you want to try the second deck? Uh, sure.